Friday night baseball from the K. Coughlin Stadium in Kansas. Digging in once again. Champ boys in a tight game, Matt, especially when you're kind of due to do something productive. And he will deliver one of the biggest at bats of the night. It's a base hit. One run is scored into the year. So that'll Five just about do it. For hits. Harold Reynolds, Dan Plezak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. This is MLB The Show has Saturday Night Baseball from Kauffman Stadium in Kansas City, Missouri. Stepping they've dropped six straight coming in. Matt, when you're on a struggling team. There's a swing, and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. Dozier ranging back, and it's gone. It's a two-run shot to straightaway left. Eighth home run on the season for him, as the D-backs have now taken a 3 to nothing lead. Yeah, you never want to give up anything in the first inning, but to go down 3-0, it's just painful. Can't afford any more early mistakes, or the hole's going to be too deep to climb out of. Trying to pick this inning. He's set, and the 2-1 pitch. Here's a shot to left field and deep. Look at this! Over the bullpen and into the stands. That's so a three-run blast to straightaway left. His second home run of the game. As they pile on, it's now six to nothing. Ready once again. Here's the first pitch to him. Swing and oh my. Hit him with the high. And out of here. And I mean by plenty. That ball, a two-run homer down the line and left. His third home run of the ball game. And just like that, it's down to a three-run ball game. Well, you have a great night in hockey. You score three goals, and that's a hat trick. But how about hitting three home runs in one night? That's the baseball equivalent of a hat trick, and that's awfully hard to do. Earns his third win of the year in relief. Patrick Corbin couldn't escape the fourth inning as he slapped with the loss. So that'll. Afternoon baseball now on a fine Sunday from Kauffman Stadium in Kansas City. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the one two. Hit sharply on the ground. Oh, a reaching try as he knocks it down, and they'll have no. Look at the Diamondbacks starting lineup. Harold, what's their focus as they go for their first win? Matt, I think the key here is their game plan at the plate. They have to be selective. They have to understand who's on the mound and when he's going to get wild and when he's going to give you something to hit. Ready for another dangerous, dangerous pitch right there. He got away with one. The guy took measuring him up. I wouldn't come back with that again. Oh, and this is hit high and deep out to left. And they have taken the lead. Solo shot here to left. First home run of the campaign for him as they take the lead four to three. I can tell you one thing. You might get away with throwing a ball in that location in the minor leagues. But when you get one up like that in the zone right over the plate against these guys, you're going to get exactly what he got. A really bad result. Hey, you could probably make an argument for a couple of other guys, too, but it seemed like he had. From one of the more hitter friendly yards in the big leagues, a look at Great American Ballpark. Behind that swing, pretty obvious he was trying to put four runs on the board. This is line to left. 
That's in there. Base hit. One run scores. Man, he turned on that fastball right there. No, he's looking for something up there to drive, but that was just a little above his happy zone. Not everyone has the discipline to hold back on those. The relay, and he's able to hustle his way up to second. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. Rocket rounds third and is digging for the plate. And the run is in to score from second. And our crew, I'm Matt Vaskirchen. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way on over to the show nation. Sun's starting to set now over Great American Ballpark in Cincinnati. Ready once again from the windup, the 1-1 pitch. Line drive to left, and that finds some outfield grass. It's a base hit. So it's a good start to the inning for the Diamondbacks. Lead-off hitters aboard. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. Hamilton going back. Gone! And good for him. Phil able to work four innings as he takes the loss. Rysel Iglesias wraps it up for the save, his first of the year. Live from the banks of the Ohio, we welcome you to Great American Ballpark. In going Votto. Hard hit ball to second. A dive. He's got it. The throw to first. He is out. Thompson. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. One -one. Hit hard on the ground towards second. Oh, look at the sliding stop. Got him. <laughs> Digging in to try it again. A diving try, but it's through into the outfield. And they won't even attempt to run on that arm. Well, the clear skies typically mean a strikeout this far. Hoping to send him packing. Pitch on its way. Chopped weakly to the left. There's one. Return throw is in time. How about that? They do... They can to get a four W. Runs, a one-run one finish, four to three, the final tally today. Yulis Chassin gets the. Well, the clear skies typically mean one thing: a hot afternoon here at Taiwan Walker. He's gone two for six. He's taken him deep once. Here's a little chopper up the middle. Throw to first in time. One gone here in the fourth. Into the box. Oh, that tells me that's a pitch you feel really confident. Oh, and this fastball is belted to deep left center field. Does he have enough to get out of here? Yes, a home run. So a three-run shot to left center. When that pitch was grooved right down Main Street, he couldn't believe it. He started salivating when he saw it, but stayed back enough to put a great swing on it. I'll do it for us this afternoon. Thanks to Harold Reynolds and Dan Plesak and the rest of our crew. I'm Matt Vaskirchen. This afternoon baseball at Chase Field on a fine Sunday in the day. Digging in. This one's down to third. Oh, and he can't pick it up cleanly. into the box and, now. but the cat mouse game continues on smoked on the ground up the middle and the inning will continue as that's through for a two out hit two out lightning here they come Tuesday night baseball here on the show from Chase Field in <laughs> 0-1 count, and the pitch. Hit hard on the ground is short. Owings has it. There's one. Relay to first in time, and just like that, this... Stepping up into the windup. Here comes the 2-2 pitch. Oh, and this ball is absolutely blasted. High and deep. That one is out of here. This game is a solo shot down the line in left. 
well. That pitch was up in the zone. Sometimes on a pitch like that, all you've got to do is just touch it. You can see he got the barrel up there, and because the height of the pitch, the ball's trajectory is going to carry out of the ballpark. Working for the punch out and the offering. Now a ball grounded to short. This could be two. One there. On to first. And for the second time in three. Ready once again. Here's the 1-1. One, one. Here's a swing and a ground ball. And that's through for a hit. And that'll score the run from third. And don't look now, but the lead's cut to two here for the season. So that just about does it for Harold Reynolds, Dan Plezak, and our crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB. The well, the clear skies typically between the L.A. Dodgers and the Arizona Diamond. Not a big sample size. 0 for 1. Swing and a soft liner. And. And this is taken for the out. Now with the plate. Smoked on the ground left side. And that's through into left field for a base hit. Now a long throw home. And this will not be close and the run will score easily. Why comes up with the 3 2 with the bases loaded. Here's a swing, and oh boy, this could be trouble. And it is trouble. That should be extra bases. Two-run score. And a relay to the plate. Pro won't get him. Downtown San Diego and Petco and Park. Sardinia. The 0-2 home. Now a ball grounded to short. This could be two. There's one. On to Goldschmidt, a double play. Inning over. So they go Digging in, even though he hasn't really gotten a ton of swings and misses. Yeah, it amazes me how every game you pitch can be so different, Matt. Sometimes it feels like guys can't touch you and you're just punching everyone out. But other times, you don't have your good stuff and you really rely on movement and location to get outs. That's been the case for him today, and it's really working. Ready for another. It's a little closer, you might get a swing. And that's in for his second hit of the afternoon. Long throw to third. And he's safe. And they'll have runners at second and third. Jimmy Weaver. Ready on two balls and two strikes. Here it comes. Grounded back up the middle. One there. On to first. And he really paid the price at second base. But it's a double play.